Hi, this is Richard Byrne. In this video, we're going to take a look at 10i.com, which is a free tool for conducting reverse image searches. So unlike a lot of image search tools where you enter a search term, here we're going to upload an image or a link to an image and find out more information about it. For example, where it came from originally. So let's go ahead and upload an image here that I have on my computer. And you can see that one there. Now I've used this on a couple of different blog posts over the years and we're going to see where it shows up on the web. So there it is. We can now see where it was uh, originally posted. You can see the website it was originally posted on. We can see the, uh, the page it was on. So if I wanted to click out and link to it, I can view that page itself. We can also see the name of the image. Now you notice I have used a couple different names for the image over the years um, and we can see when it was crawled again there. Now let's go ahead and click on it okay. and this will open up the page in which that image was found. And so it'll be down here on this page and there it is. Okay. So that's where I used that image. Now from a practical standpoint, this is a great way to double check that an image that you think is in the public domain really is in the public domain. It's also a nice tool for students when they find a picture and they want to know more information about it. So we'll give another example here. Let's go ahead and upload an image. I have a picture here of the Sydney Opera House. And I'll go ahead and upload that. And now we'll see it's looking for similar matches now, that's obviously not the same picture, but it's a very similar picture. These two are the picture, the original pictures. And so we can do a comparison here by clicking on Compare Match, and we can do a side-by-side -side look at the two to make sure we're looking at the same image. And in this case, this one is not, but these other two are. Now, one other way we can uh, use 10i is to put in a link to an image. So let's say we've gone on a website like uh, photosforclass.com and we found a picture of a puppy if we right click on that and we'll copy the link address and we can paste it in here and now it'll look for that image on all the places that it has appeared. And we can see it's appeared on Photos for Class but it was originally put on Flickr.com and there's the original source of that image. We can see all these other places where that image has been used and if you wanted to double check that the image was used properly you could click through and make sure that the attribution information was added or not. So that's a short overview of 10i. Again, it's a nice reverse image search tool. For more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com.